the first just came up there, milled here, and gonna go like a boss ass bitch came down here. So I'm going to Oxford today. Um, ooh, son. So I'm going to Oxford because, again, Harry Potter, they filmed a heap of Harry Potter scenes there. The infirmary for the hospital being in a couple of the movies was there. Uh, the Great Hall, at least the inspiration to the Great Hall's there and the entrance or something into it. The library, like where they filmed the restricted section scenes, that sort of thing. So I should probably go. <laughs> All right, so I'm at Pennington Station, as you can probably see, um, and I'm taking the Platform 4 train, I think, to Oxford. Should take me straight there and take about an hour. Alright, so I'm now in Oxford. Let's try and find all the Harry Potter film locations. I think there's one there. So this college cloisters where they film that scene under the tree and everything. So I've done a full lappy. And apparently, in winter, it's open between two and four. And you have to take the entrance through Hollywell Street. But it's free admission, whereas in the summer it costs three pounds. So for those of you who want to look at the college cloisters yourself, I'm going to show you what the front looks like so you won't have as much trouble finding it as I did. So I found it, but it is open from 2 till 4, so I'll have to come back at 2 in about an hour. Got myself a cough, classic. And now I'm heading back to the college cloisters. Let's check out the tree. So this place is pretty cool, already looking quite Hogwartsy. I don't know where to explore. Let's have a look. Definitely should have come to Oxford earlier in the morning because there seems like there's so much more to look at than I thought there was going to be. Imagine going to college here though, Jesus, how beautiful is this? Imagine living here. So I climbed the stairs and found this cute little area. With squirrels. And I was walking up here, I was like, I bet this is where the kids go to get high. Close enough. I think we're getting close. Why not? So I think Malfoy is set. My father and I have a bet, you see. I don't think you're going to last ten minutes in this tournament. He disagrees. He thinks you won't last five. I don't give a <laughs> damn what your father thinks, Malfoy. You. Come with me. This is the hospital wing from Harry Potter and Philosopher's Stone, and also where Professor McGonagall in Goblet of Fire teaches them how to dance for the Yule Ball. So I'll do a comparison shot. The stone has been destroyed. My friend Nicholas and I have had a little chat and agreed it was best.
yeah, the tour went way over time. I was like, how long does it go for? Does it take the full 30 minutes? And he was like, yeah, it's like, like it'll take the full 30. And then we were like 45 and I was like, dude. Now I'm heading to Christchurch to try and cram in things before I leave. Be aware, it's seven pound to get in. Let's see if we can find all the locations. dining hall. Apparently they drew inspiration from it but then they recreated it in a lab so they didn't actually do any of the filming yet. And when I mean lab I mean studio. That was cool. It looks more Hogwarts in real life than what I thought it would from the pictures that I've seen and that definitely is the welcome to Hogwarts stairs. Let's walk down then. First, just came up there, milled here, McGonagall, like a boss ass bitch, came down here, and she stood there. Welcome to Hogwarts. Your house will be something like your family. It's a really bad accent. Whilst any rule breaking will lose your points. Apparently, I've come at a good time because usually, apparently, <laughs> apparently, there's a heap of visitors around, so you can't actually get a clear photo. I think this is the Cloisters. Somewhere here, Hermione told Harry that his dad was a Quidditch player. So he like, sh she shows him the Quidditch trophy, but I don't know. Nothing really looks like that here. All right, I managed to mark all seven Harry Potter locations off my list, so. All right, I think overall that was a very successful day. If you guys liked what you saw today, don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date with all of my travel vids. I need to actually head off to the train now because I'm going to miss it if I don't get there soon. So, catch you soon.